Okay, guys, now here we are. I started to make that wig. The first thing that I like to do, the first thing I did is I sewed the closure on to the dome cap. So that's the first thing I do. This is most important to me. And then the second thing that's kind of important for me, I take a track and I drop it all the way at the bottom and take it all the way around. And then from there, I can start moving them anyway. But the reason why, and I bring it, well, this is going to be all the way down. The pin is moving, but all the way down at the bottom. And the reason why is that um, then I can start spacing them out, my tracks. But I like to have one. I like to do the closure. Sew that down. That's secured with the sewing machine. And then I like to do that one track that's all the way at the bottom. And then, guys... From there, you guys can just pretty much um, do your own flow. How many inches apart you will want your uh, track. So if you want it uh, an inch apart, then you do your next one. You want it two inches apart, then you do your next one two inches apart. It's pretty much your world. From there on, it's the way you want it. And the reason why I got it on this dome head is so that this is a small. This is my head measurements. And as I'm sewing with this sewing machine, I go from here to there, from here to there from here to there so that I will have it on there like perfect so this part has already been sewed down so guys that will be the way the next time you guys will see this wig it will be totally created so thank you guys for tuning in but that's the steps I would take god bless bye bye